She was planning a vacation with friends in the Florida area when she realized the dates they chose were during spring break. I went to Craig's list as a last resort, and sure enough, there was a listing. She was thrilled. The property was in the perfect location. He had told me to go to the website to look right on the beach, and we could have it for the four nights. Perfect. She set their deposit of $1,600 to the Coastline Realtors right away. He sent us back a uh, written document, which was the contract, about three pages worth of the do's, the don'ts. A few days before their expected arrival, she called asking where to pick up the keys. No answer. Then she got an email. Unfortunately, he had overbooked the condo. He would be uh, refunding our deposit. But no money ever came. I am beyond angry, you know, for ruining our plans. Michael Carlton had scammed more than 100 people out of money and their vacations, with losses over $200,000. He started renting out these properties in multiples. So he would rent out to one customer, and then he would rent out to another customer. Inspectors say research is key. In fact, many poor reviews had been written about Carlton on internet travel sites. Google the company that's doing the rental, Google the address, Google the property manager's name, you know, just try several different variations just to see what you find out.